What's up guys, Attacking Two Cans here, making an update video, which is something that I don't do enough, but need to do more of. So I'm making this update video to let you guys know that I am back to full-time content creation. For those of you who don't know, I've been very, very busy over the past few months because one, I moved across the country from Missouri to California and I just finally got a house. I have some roommates and they're also Let's Players, so we're gonna be collabing a lot and doing lots of cool stuff. I hosted a convention called Versus Expo in Chicago, which went amazingly. It was so much fun. I got to meet a couple hundred of you guys and we rose money for charity and it was just an all around fantastic time. And it is definitely happening next year. Versus Expo 2020 is happening in Chicago. Details coming soon. We had the Renobly Guys Coliseum and that was like a bunch of Let's Players that got together and we rose money for charity as well. And then also I had a family cruise, which my dad proposed to his girlfriend. So I'm about to have a stepmom, which is kind of cool. And all of that has led to me not being able to stream or upload very much over the past six, seven months, because mostly the convention was the biggest part. Planning a convention is way more work than I expected. I mean, I expected a lot of work, but it was even more, it was like way more on top of that. But it went really well and I'm really happy with it. So this video is to pretty much let you guys know that all that stuff is over. I am now pretty much a free man <laughs> for the most part. I mean, I still have a lot of other responsibilities because just being an adult is a bitch, right? But I, <laughs> I have a lot more time. So I'm about to get into full-time Let's Playing again and streaming. So I'm about to tell you guys some details about how that is going to work out. So the first thing I want to tell you guys about is in case you didn't already know, I have a new second channel called Toucans, and I've uploaded around 50 videos already to that channel. Pretty much what it is, is the live streams I do on Twitch and wherever I do live streams at. I'm about to start doing some YouTube live streams too, just to test that out. But whatever live streams I do, I am now editing those down into Let's Play videos. And when I say editing them down, I'm really editing them really well. So if you like watch the videos on my second channel, they're pretty much like Let's Plays, except a little bit better in some aspects because there's a lot more jokes because I have chat to like bounce back off of and stuff. So there's like full Let's Plays in that channel. I have a Majora's Mask randomizer up there. I did a ROM hack of Ocarina of Time. I've done multi-world randomizer with Josh Jepsen, Tom Fox, and Nintendo Capri Sun. And there's gonna be so many things there. And any single stream that I do on Twitch or YouTube, if the stream goes well, those videos will be edited down and put on the second channel. So for anybody asking, yes, streams will now be uploaded to YouTube. So in case you ever miss a stream, if I ever stream something that you wanted to see, if I played a game, but you weren't able to make it because I know how live streams can be, I'm now editing those into content that is very, very enjoyable. I would honestly say some of my live stream Let's Plays are better than my regular Let's Plays. I'm very, very proud of that content and I'm very excited to see where that can possibly go. Uh, speaking of streams, I decided that this summer I'm going to dabble a bit more into YouTube streams. In the past, YouTube streams were not very good, but YouTube has been updating their streaming services pretty consistently. And I decided that since most of my subscribers are here on YouTube, I would try out some YouTube streams just to give it a shot. I'm still gonna be doing some Twitch streams every single week on my Twitch channel as well. And you can also find links to everything down in the description, by the way. Um, but I'm gonna be doing some Twitch streams as well because I still love Twitch. I love their streaming platform and it's a lot more, it's a lot, it's a lot better in lots of ways and I don't wanna completely scrap it yet. But yeah, we're gonna be doing lots of YouTube streams. The streams that I'm gonna be doing this summer is we're gonna be playing lots of games for the first time. Um, some games that I wanna play on YouTube this summer is I wanna play through the Metroid Prime series, some of the Zelda games I've never played through and just some Zelda games in general. A lot more randomizers, whether it be for Zelda, Mario, or whatever games that I'm feeling at the time. I really wanna stream the new Animal Crossing game, maybe some Stardew Valley. I wanna try out the Persona series, maybe with Persona 3, 4, 5. I'm not sure which one's the best, but I wanna stream through a Persona game. I'm gonna be doing way more community stuff, playing games with you guys. In the past, I've done community Minecraft streams, such as 100 person builds and like Survivor Worlds and stuff where I just play Minecraft with you guys. And I really wanna bring those back because I feel like that's a game that a lot of people can play together. But I'm also gonna play games with you guys like Mario Maker, definitely gonna play lots of that. A Hat in Time now has a mode where you can play the game with like 50 people. So I'm gonna try to get into that, like Towers Unite, um, Golf with Friends, Ultimate Chicken Horse, Smash Bros, Mario Kart. I really wanna get into more multiplayer games on my streaming, on my streams. So that's something I'm gonna be trying out. 
and I'm really excited to try all this stuff. Lots of fun games. Like, there's just so many games I want to play, and now that I have a lot more free time, that's kind of what I plan to do. But don't worry, I'm still going to be doing regular Let's Play stuff as well, because there's lots of people who just absolutely hate stream type content, and I completely understand. So I'm still going to be trying to post 5 to 6 Let's Play videos every single week to my main channel, Attacking Toucans. So the Let's Plays we're going to be doing this summer is I'm still going to be continuing Let's Build the Ultimate Theme Park as per usual, because that is like my favorite series I've ever made, and I'm just going to keep on adding on to it as long as I possibly can. I'm going to be doing Zooter 3 this summer, that's going to be our big one. Zooter 3 is going to be like an ultimate sanity. We're going to have Token Sanity turned on, Cow Sanity, Scrub Sanity, Shop Sanity, Song Sanity, pretty much every single option, whatever I can do to make the game more difficult for myself. I'm going to do that just so you guys can watch me lose all of my sanity on camera. I'm going to do an official Majora's Mask randomizer this summer. I'm going to be doing a Tony Hawk Let's Play and other various games. I have quite a few other games planned, but those are like the big ones I have planned. But like I said, there's going to be quite a bit of variety for the content because I'm going into this for the first time because this is like the first time that this is going to be my 100% focus. Over the next three to four months, I am just dedicating my life to Let's Plays and streams because now that that's the reason I moved to California in the first place is I wanted to get into a location and environment to where I can work on this stuff and really feel like I'm in the right area to continue progressing. When I was in Missouri, it didn't quite feel that way. I felt a little bit trapped. I didn't really feel as motivated to do my very best because everything felt like so closed in. Like it didn't feel like there was anywhere to go in Missouri. Like once I like reached any moderate success, I was like, all right, now what? But in California, things are different. I'm in an office with lots of content creators I look up to like Gerard, the completionist. He's like in the room right next to me. I hear him recording. Hopefully you can't hear it on the mic. It's pretty omnidirectional. But I have, um, I'm living with like my, my roommates, Fearsome Fire, Soli Pones, Troy WD. There's lots of other Let's Players in this office and streamers. And like just being around that environment just like really pushes me to be a better version of myself. So that's why I wanted to move and just be in an environment that really helped me be the best version of me that I could be. I'm also gonna be working on music this summer. I'm turning my office into a recording studio and I plan to bring back music. I've been writing lots of songs and my song journal I already have like almost 30 songs written for my next album. I just gotta start getting into the recording and production side, which is very painful and difficult, but I really wanna really get into it because I really love music. I also just wanna continue experimenting with just different types of like gaming media and just media in general. You're probably gonna see a lot of interesting stuff this summer. Another thing that I just remembered is me and my roommates just started a vlog last month that is pretty damn entertaining. Um, my best friend Cole is the one filming and editing it, and he's doing a phenomenal job. And it would really mean a lot if you guys could check out that channel. I'll put a link down in the description. Or if you want to search for it, just search Soli Vlog. My roommate Soli is the one who is curating it. He's the one who's paying Cole to like, help film and edit it and everything. And this really is really cool. We've already done quite a few things. There's an episode where I actually filmed Soli accidentally breaking his leg. I got it on film, and it was insane. And there's also like a vlog about Versus Expo on there, like our adventures in Chicago and LA. So lots of fun stuff. So if you guys want to like take a peek into our real life day to day stuff, then you can go check out that vlog. I'm also going to be doing some like more discussion videos probably where I discuss like gaming news and stuff. So I'll be starting off with like E3. I want to talk about E3 and some of the stuff related to that. And also just like when games come out that I'm interested in, uh, like Zelda, Mario, stuff like that. I want to start doing some more like discussion videos. And then lastly, Versus. Starting this next week, we're going to be uploading all of the runs and races we did at Versus Expo onto the Versus channel. And then Josh and I will start doing some more Versus related stuff as well. And along with that, I'm going to start doing even more Versus on attacking two cans with some of my other friends. I'm just Versus is just like a thing I like to do that's fun and social, and so I'm just going to be playing around with it. For me, YouTube's just fun. I kind of just upload <laughs> whatever I want to, whenever I want to, sort of, because I feel like if I treat it that way, I never get burnt out, and I always consistently enjoy what I'm doing. And I'm just really excited for everything. So anyways, if you guys have any questions about my content or anything, you can leave them down in the comment section below. I'll answer any questions over the first couple days um, with them posting the video. I want you guys, I just want to be as transparent with my content as possible and I just want to stay connected with you guys and I'm going to try to do that. I'm going to try to like just keep you guys in the loop a little bit more. Um, to stay fully in the loop, I'd advise you to follow me on Twitter 
because I post quite a bit of stuff about my content on there, like stream announcements and everything. But apart from that, I'm thinking about maybe making like a monthly update video or something just to kind of like let you guys know what's happening. But anyways, with that, I think that's all I have to talk about. This Friday, in two days, I'm going to be doing a subathon on my Twitch channel to really get things popping on my Twitch channel again uh, because I've definitely taken, I definitely haven't been working on that the way I want to for the past like six or seven months. So I just want to like get stuff off to a bang by doing just like a big stream to really get myself motivated and to just like really bring us all together for one big stream. So this Friday at 5 p.m. Pacific time, that is 8 p.m. Eastern time, I'm going to be doing a very long subathon where you guys can extend the length of the stream by subbing to my Twitch channel, which will in turn help me out a ton and help me make even more content for you guys, which is hopefully what you want. <laughs> Anyways, thank you all so much for watching. I love you all so much. Thank you for being patient with me and waiting for me to come back. For those of you who waited, some of you are probably like, yeet, fuck this guy. But no, I really appreciate it. You guys are all awesome. I'm just really thankful I'm in a situation where I'm now in an environment where I feel super motivated and I'm really excited to start this next chapter of my life. So welcome to the next chapter of Attacking Toucans. Flipping the page. It's gonna be interesting. <laughs> That's to say the least. Anyways, love you guys, bye.